Smoke Barbecue has only been around here for four years on Tremainsville, but it's already got a loyal base of customers. I'm gonna go inside, find out why. Although smoke is relatively new to the area, owner John Brown is no stranger to the 419 restaurant scene. And those who have spent any amount of time in Bowling Green are more than likely familiar with his brand. I had two taverns, one in Bowling Green, one in South Toledo called Trotter's Taverns. And at 65 years old, I sold everything. I retired. That lasted two years, and uh, I got the itch again. <laughs> I'm, I'm back at it. But smoke is no Trotter's. John is now exclusively hardcore barbecue. I would say our barbecue style is kind of a Kansas City barbecue uh, style. I'm a Kansas City Barbecue Society table captain and judge. We're a wood uh, pit barbecue operation here. Uh, we have no gas assistance or no electric assistance on our uh, meats that we smoke here. We use a lot of uh, uh, cherry. We use split wood with uh, bark-free wood that we smoke our meats with. We smoke ribs, we do beef brisket, we do sausage, uh, we do pulled pork, sliced pork, hams, uh, chickens, half chickens, but we smoke just about anything you, <laughs> you can possibly smoke in this place, you know, so that's, that's uh, pretty much what we do over here. I'm anxious to try some of this. Do you mind if we step in the kitchen and see what you guys are cooking yeah, up back there? Yeah, absolutely. All right, let's absolutely. do it. Absolutely. Let's go. All right. All right. All right. All right. John Smoker is one of only two of this model in Ohio, and it is so well regarded that Chef Michael Simon came right here to Toledo to taste John's product before purchasing the same model for his barbecue restaurant in Cleveland. Uh, they've been in a smoker for about four hours, these wings have, and then we deep fry them to crisp them up. We serve them naked, and we serve them with sauce. Give you guys a couple this of This is just your standard barbecue this sauce. This is just standard barbecue sauce. Now we can do them hot, we can do just irregular uh, butter and uh, hot sauce type uh, wings with them, you know, but uh, and we can I'd do imagine them. adding a little bit of that mustard barbecue sauce. The too. mustard's would great. Be a nice touch. The mustard's great on them, you know, so. Did you uh, make the barbecue sauce yourself then? Yeah, we make barbecue sauce and uh, really a we, use, we, use, we use uh, different types of bases and then we uh, use our own ingredients in it, what have you, you know, and we cook our own barbecue sauce. Yeah. Right. I'm but, gonna rip yeah. into one of these. Yeah, I mind. want you. I want you to. All right. I want you to try one. They're they're probably be a little hot right they're now. You know, but hot. Yeah, they're a little on the hot side. Give them a whirl. You guys, I want you guys to eat them. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That is good. Yeah, they're tasty. Like I said, you can just sort of. Yeah. Goes right up your nose. Yeah. Yeah. That is tremendous. And this is just your regular barbecue sauce. I like that. Yeah. I love the wings. The wings are the best I've had in town. The wings are excellent. Big, meaty, well done. This is going to be the sliced pork sandwich. We make this out of a pork cushion. It's actually like a picnic ham with the, uh, the joint knuckle uh, taken out of it. And uh, we usually do them with a few pickles. And I actually like the mustard barbecue sauce. But that's uh, kind of a nice looking sandwich right there. What, what's you this know? called on your menu? Yeah, this is this, just, just a sliced, uh, sliced pork sandwich. Is it? comes with a side, it's $8.95. I'll take one. Yeah. Oh, there it is. You know what I like about this? Yeah. yeah. Very simple. Yeah. You know, four pickles on there, a little bit of mustard, and yeah. that's all you need. Yeah. I'm going to cut that, and I'm going to let you guys, I want you guys to taste that. Look at that. That's all you need right there. Yeah. And let's just eat it. Enough talking. That's a key. Mustard barbecue sauce with that pickle. Just a good mix of flavor in that pork. And the toasted bun, too. You can't look past that. That makes a difference. 41 Nosh is brought to you by Tanks Meats in Elmore. Family owned and operated since 1907.